Hello everybody, good morning, good evening, good whatever time it is for you right now. I hope you have had a wonderful time so far and you have a nice drink like coffee or a mug of tea with you to enjoy this little video I did. It has been quite some time since I have done the last video of me talking about my life and once I realized that I thought it's now time to do a new one. Today you will see an official art for Call Me's new voice bank which is again a CV one. I will probably call the pen puppet unless you have like a better idea. Feel free to write this in the comments because I'm really searching for a pen names. I am like already talking too much about things that are not even the topic of this video because what's actually the topic is a Q&A I announced on Twitter and I got some questions, not that many, so I will really elaborate my answers and I hope you will enjoy this. Anthony asked, have you been watching any shows recently? Yes, of course I did. I mentioned in a Q&A like probably three years ago that I really love anime but I sadly don't have that much time to watch them. I more often read manga. Yet it has been like 40 degrees Celsius in Germany a few weeks ago, so I couldn't do much more than watching shows. So I rewatched Elfenlied. I kind of tried to watch it back the days on YouTube when I was 12-ish and I did not understand anything. Once I rewatched it, I actually enjoyed it. I also plan to do the same thing to Higurashi because I also tried to watch it when I was much too young for it. And I rewatched Shiki like one year ago and you might think that's a long time, it probably is, but the hyperfixation stick with me for so long. It's it's still there kinda. I don't know whether rewatching the show was like the greatest mistake I ever did because I am like addicted to Shiki at this point. I did like 1000 paintings. I even started writing a fan fiction. I cosplayed Megami Shimizu for Halloween last year. I literally would sell my kidney to get my hands on an English version of the uh, novel the anime is based on. I I'm playing the soundtrack on repeat, like on a daily basis. I'm trying to play it on three different instruments, on my recorder, on my piano, on my electric guitar. I'm so close to upload tons of random shiki content. I, I, I can't stop thinking about it and, and I have to tell everybody how great this show is. So if you don't know it and if you have like the slightest, the slightest like for like horror anime or vampire anime, please now watch it. I can't elaborate it enough. It's such a good, amazing show. I know some people say it's mediocre. I know some people dislike the art style because it's not beautiful, but I think these things really tie the story together, like the art style, the absolutely wonderful music and the storyline, it's just, it's just pure gold for me, period. But at least, luckily you could say my Onibi series hyperfixation is making me hyperfixate less on Shiki. I don't know whether that's good because that kinda wants me to translate the entire Unibi series into German and do synthesizer recovers, which is, if you know the songs, extremely difficult, but I would really like that. If we look outside of anime and manga, I recently watched Heartstopper and First Kill, which has been like my first introduction to queer media, unless you count the Onibi series as queer media, which you could technically do. And yeah, Heartstopper was very nice. It was like a chill, cute series, but it was not nothing too special for me because it's not really my genre. And First Kill seemed like everything I ever wanted into my life from the description. But you know, if you have watched it as well. The production isn't the best, probably the budget was very small. I think it's a mediocre show. It's not really bad. It really plays with the lesbian vampire trope and does things differently. It's like 
lesbian vampire but not for the male gaze which I really enjoy but it's not quite enough yet so it's like it's like the series we need but it's not yet the series 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 god I can't freaking speak we all deserve let's put it like this but of course if you enjoy it I won't um, tell you otherwise it's just my personal opinion Lunari asks, what animal would you like to be and why? Without thinking too much about it, I'd probably choose a cat or a rat, because I personally can identify with those animals. I think they are very cute and I'd like to keep them as a pet soon. But if I really think about it and I'm trying to find a reason for my answer, I kind of had to realize that human treat most of the animals around them when are probably all pretty much like shit so I wouldn't like to be an animal but if I had to choose one considering this I'd also think about um, which other animals would hunt me or kill me for food reasons this is also something I would not like I don't want to be eaten and then I try to find animals which won't get hunted by other animals and also not by human and I think I found an animal which is decent it's not perfect which is the hammerhead shark it's not allowed to like kill it and capture it anymore I know that not everybody really takes those rules serious but there's higher chance of surviving and not being killed by human if you get my point and then there's also the problem that while there are no other animals that feed upon hammer hedgehogs they are cannibalistic and they eat like um, hammer hedgehogs which are pretty small but I'm rather tall for a human, so I would guess if I was a hammerhead shark, I'd also be rather tall. And that's why I hope other hammerhead sharks wouldn't eat me. That's my logic. So yeah, if I had to choose an animal which I wanted to be, then I'd be a hammerhead shark. Oh my god, this is getting... it's getting insane. Zimtröschen asked... What projects are you currently working on and up to release? It's very good you're asking that question. Actually, I'm working obviously on the voice bank release for the third CV act of Koimi. This will probably be a Japanese cover, obviously Japanese, it's a Japanese voice bank, of Corpse Dance by Kiku. Probably, if I find the time, I will finally release the new German original I have been planning for decades. And along that, I will do like other covers as I please. Like, if I have a song that I really like at the moment, there's a chance I will cover it sooner or later. And that's probably it for now. If you have like any recommendations or like inspirations rather what I could do, I'd be very happy if you like send them to me because I can always need them. I probably don't have the time to do any project but there might be something that I'm really interested to and where I'm like, oh I haven't thought of this, I could really do that, I really want to do that because I'm not able to put the, the very small time I'm having into projects I'm not like 100% loving. I, as always, am open to do more talking videos. Please just tell me basically whether you like this type of content and if you do, I can make a lot of other videos talking about why Shiki is the best anime you will ever watch. And I can do a lot of other videos where I think too much about a random question which is probably not even meant that deep. And having that said, I really thank you for like watching this and for being a fan of mine, for being on this channel, for gifting me your views. That's very nice of you and of course also for supporting me and supporting my music. I hope you enjoyed this like random video I did. Yeah, that's basically it. Goodbye!